the Sheep Ranch, the newest 18-hole course at Bandon Dunes Golf Resort in Western Oregon, opens June 1. And ever since I played a preview round on the Cliffside Thriller in early March, everyone keeps asking me the same question. Is this the best course at the resort? Well, to be honest, I don't know how to answer that. All of the four previous 18-hole courses at the resort, Bandon Dunes, Pacific Dunes, Old McDonald, and Bandon Trails, rank inside the top 15 on Golf Week's best list of modern courses in the United States. So how do you top those? If you're the architects in charge of building the Sheep Ranch, you don't try. Bill Corr and Ben Crenshaw set out to build a complement to the other courses, not necessarily a competitor to them. Corr told me recently that the best any course designer can do is to make the most of a site, build the best product possible, then sit back and see what people think. And trust me, Corr and Crenshaw have nothing to worry about. The Sheep Ranch is simply amazing. The course features nine greens on cliffs that tower over the Pacific Ocean, exposed to the kind of winds that might be named by the National Weather Service if they occurred in the tropics. The cliffs steal the show, of course. With greens and tees placed atop promontories, it's the first chance at the resort to send balls sailing over the cliffs, 100 feet above the beach and ocean below, toward targets that seem to be surrounded by nothing but air. But so much of what makes this new sheep ranch special is the rolling topography that has to be seen to be believed. There is not a flat spot on the property. The course was built on a relatively tight piece of land that might look somewhat flat from afar, but once you sink your spikes into that first tee box, the ground moves down and away towards the ocean, then back up towards the hills, back down to the cliffs, always flowing like an ocean wave. Core told me that the sheep ranch was always going to be very different than the other courses at Bandon Dunes, and aside from the ocean views, he could not be more correct. A golfer can see the entire venue from almost any vantage point. You can see the other players, and you might frequently come into contact with them as several holes share common teeing areas before fanning out like the spokes on a bicycle. It's a small ballpark that somehow still plays wide, a credit to Coors Rowdy. And when that wind is howling, any player will appreciate that extra width. The only thing missing at the Sheep Ranch is traditional bunkers, and that is by design. With winds that frequently surpass 30 miles per hour, the sand would blow out of the bunkers, creating a maintenance headache. Core and Crenshaw decided it would be better to leave out the traps, and Core said that if ever there was a site so blessed by topography as to not need the bunkers, the Sheep Ranch might be that spot. So the question remains, is the Sheep Ranch the best course at the resort? Only time will tell where it ranks. But one thing is for certain, if you are going to Bandon Dunes to play golf, there's no way in the world that you want to miss this.